Going to London Gatwick overnight yeah, to see how the new boarding. boat's going. Hello. You're down this way, 30 feet. Thank you. 30, woohoo. All right, going to London to take a look at the new boat, how we're doing with that. Okay, starting the Distant Shores 3 project. We're heading down to the south coast of England, but first going to visit family in Cornwall and driving on the left side of the road with uh, only hardly any sleep on the airplane. That's great. reason for coming over to England was to meet up with Discovery. We'll be working with them building our new 48-footer. Gorgeous spring day. We're gonna go out for a sail on Discovery 55. It's kind of similar features will be on our Discovery 48. So we just want to see how it all works. Get a chance to sail a Discovery for the first time. Now well, there's a nice feature. You can put two spinnaker poles on the mast. We had one, which was great, but to be able to run downwind, you could use this to do both. That's pretty cool. Boarding ladder integrated, ready to go. Put our stuff away.
It's always fun to look at different galley layouts. This is a super system for being at sea. If you're on passage, you're really locked in here. And uh, you don't even need a galley strap at the stove because you can be here. Lots of pot clamps on the oven and it gimbals. Yeah, so there's a draining rack and sink as well as to, you know, the double sink system, which is great. I love all the drawers in this galley. There is just so much storage space and everything has fiddles so you're secure. Oop. And a large front opening fridge. So just like home. The galley is actually a hallway into the beautiful aft cabin. This is the dream helm down here. We have perfect views of the whole 180 degrees ahead or 270 degrees. You can see forward to steer. Autopilot is right here, charts and a great view forward. Okay, we're in the new forest, and this is a traffic jam this morning. Got to get let this guy get past. Hello. In point two miles, turn right on B three o five four. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, business meetings this morning. Talking to Discovery Yachts about our new project. Discovery are building a new catamaran. They did a 50 footer a few years ago and a big update. And maybe we get a chance to sail one of them. Let's take a look at her. It's gonna be launching in a few weeks, maybe a month and a half, two months, I'm not sure. She's looking pretty, not totally ready yet. This boat's got a bit more clearance under the hull and a smoother bottom than the Voyage we tested. So we'll see what we can organize, but it seems like we might have a chance to do a real passage on one of these, and I would love to do a long, actual long crossing on a catamaran. So. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on upcoming videos. Are you interested in the cruising lifestyle? Are you planning to sail away on a cruising adventure? or researching cruising areas and destinations. Distant Shores is a television series about the cruising life with lots of tips for sailors planning to sail away. This is Oswego, New York. We are entering the Erie Canal system and this will take us all the way from Lake Ontario to the Hudson River, which gets us to New York City. Plus destination information to help you make your cruising plans. Yeah, I can stand on the bottom. We've been filming Distant Shores for nearly 15 years and know the fun and challenges of the cruising life. We've made Distant Shores with you in mind. We include plenty of cruising tips in this travel series, as well as lifestyle segments and hints for sailors heading to exotic destinations. Encouragement for you and your crew to get out cruising. Destinations include the Intracoastal Waterway, the Bahamas, Caribbean, the Mediterranean, Scandinavia, transatlantic passage making, the French canals and more.